up like I'm waking them up and a nigga keep falling asleep. I come and murder the bars. Who wanna spar with a beast? Shit, I've been working too hard. So I'm getting off on a week. What's good, Gold Spike? Yeah. That's all that's in this motherfucker's like two of y'all? Ah, yeah, that's cool. What's good, y'all? I'm J. Cole Water. And um, any bus riders out here with me today? Who else ride the bus? My bus riders at? Right on. Right on. Solidarity. Never done that? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. I was going to say. Yes. Okay. I just want to make sure everybody's on page with me here. Do you guys know that creepy people don't like to sit next to other creepy people on the bus? Yeah. <laughs> I do not like that shit, man. I found out because one day I'm on the bus and the creepy dude sitting next to me. And I'm looking at him like, dude, why is this creepy dude sitting next to me and shit? He's all weird, creeping me out because he just keeps staring at me. And in case you guys haven't noticed, I'm black. And we don't do staring too long, man. Right, bruh? Can't look at us for too long. Eventually, within two minutes, we're going to be like, yo, what the fuck is you looking at, dude? In two minutes, easy, quick. You keep looking at me for too long? What? Stop looking at me. But then I realized, though, my man's just looking at me the same way I'm looking at him, though. Like, why is this creepy dude sitting next to me on the bus watching porn? <laughs> like, I'm the bad guy. He smells like fish, but I'm watching porn. I'm the bad guy, right? <laughs> Jesus, criminy, man. Fuck. Hey, you guys know something, though? Here in Vegas, we got some of the most bougiest bums. Yes. Don't tell me. Yes. Bougie! These cats ain't got, got nerve to not want to take no dirty money. Yo. I'm out on my corner just doing my thing, selling my dope like I do every day, just so I can make sure I make my bills every week, you know what I mean? Because that weekly's a motherfucker. I'm just wanting y'all to know right now, that week I got to be out there. Dude, from Monday to Friday to make my week, you know what I mean? I can't, you know, I can't take no breaks off that being lazy. I got Sunday, and I said even at church I'm serving the pastor, you know what I mean? <laughs> But I'm standing up, hella, but I'm standing on the corner, right? And, and this bum dude come over, he's like, yo, bro, can you give me a dollar? I want to get a beer. You know, and I'm a good person. I believe in paying it forward, even though he ain't bought no crack for me in weeks. Been getting it free from the street. You know, I'm a little, I'm a little salty about that. He been taking money out of my pocket, giving it to somebody else. I don't like that. But I still gave him a buck, though. And he sat there and stared at me. He just stared at me, just stared at me. I was like, what? And he's contemplating, looking like he's having an existential issue in his brain, a crisis or something. He goes, I can't take your blood money. Exactly. I'm like, what do you mean you can't take my blood? But you just want to buy a beer. I lost everybody, huh? My dope money. He didn't want to spend my dope money on his beer. That's all it was. And I, and there's a street money. He didn't, yeah, he didn't want to use my drug money to buy his beer. He was just too good for that. And he live outside. <laughs> I don't even understand. I live on Boulder Highway in Russell. And for those of you guys who don't know, that is the hooker hub. Hey, Boulder yeah, Boulder bitches is the shits. <laughs> It's mostly smell, but they are the shit, though. <laughs> man, man, I live right across the street from the Siena Suites, man. They get it in, man. That's the, that, that right there, that's the, that's the hooker hideaway. They start there, you know, right? And they make their way all the way up to Fremont. <laughs> and then they come all the way back. I done seen some chicks really making that strut every day, man. Like, like no hassle, just marching. Man, I'm telling you, man. I'm, I feel as if in other cities, like when it get too cold, the hookers go inside. Not our hookers. No, these are some G's out here, man. <laughs> They'd be like, girl, just put some socks on with them sandals and get out there and get that bread. The weekly is due tomorrow, ho. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm just saying, man. So, yeah, I, I, but I, I, anybody else watch porn on the bus? Yeah, yeah us? Okay, good. I'm not the only... Uh, Normal person on the streets, good. Um, I do, I really like to watch porn on the bus, not for anything dirty like I touch myself on the bus, I save that for the bums. Not to touch me. I don't want to, yeah. <laughs> I just want to make sure I made that clear. I don't like bums touching me and I, you know, I, 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 okay, one time a um, uh, bum shook my hand one time and I, and I really tried to cut my hand off. I, I couldn't get to no soap fast enough. So I just figured I'd just cut my hand off, you know, sanitary, cauterize the blood, you know, make sure it don't bleed out. Is that too dark? No, I mean, that's just how I feel, though. It's a little dark, right? <laughs> a little dark. You know who else? Like, you can't stare at a long-ass time, though? The police. You cannot stare at the cops for too long. Because eventually they're like, what the fuck are you looking at, nigger? You know what I'm saying? And you're like, oh, shit. You can't fight the cops over that. They come equipped. They got accoutrement. Sticks, guns, handcuffs. All right, I'll stop talking about the cops. Maybe you guys are friends. I don't know. But then again, thanks, shout out to the bar for making this strong-ass free drink I got right now. 
vodka and cranberry. He put a, my man threw a double shot in there on me. And I can't even tip him, though. It's the life of a comic, you guys. Can't leave tips. Yeah. You ever try a valet park a raggedy car? <laughs> you ever try and do that shit? You ever try a valet park? I did one time, and the dude stood there and looked at me. He's like, really? A Corsica, bro? <laughs> you going to valet a Corsica? I was like, come on, man. Go back. I got a date, dude. Come on, man. I paid fair cash for this broad right here to bring her to this establishment. You got a valet parking, so I look good for her. I'm trying to get a discount off this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I live on Boulder High and Russell. We're trying to get my local discount as often as I can. I promise you I do. It's 15%, by the way. Um, so, <laughs> see, what else can I tell you guys about? Uh, I'm old as hell, and I'm um, about to divorce my wife. Yeah. Yay! Hell yeah, yay. She don't cook clean or anything. Well, I mean, okay, okay, I'm lying. She does cook food for herself. Um, <laughs> she does. Uh, so, but uh, I love her, though. I, I, I kind of love her. I kind of love her. I take her everywhere. I do. I take her everywhere. But fuck, she keeps finding her way back home. I don't took her bus pass from her and everything. And she just, I, I get, she beats me home sometimes. I get there, she's sitting on the couch. That's just going to leave me there again, huh? I'm like, ugh. I swapped bus passes one time because my bus pass was going to expire. Nope, didn't even work. She just, she just said, hey, I got to get home. And the bus driver was like, yeah, I seen him trade bus passes with you. You know, bus driver was a hater and shit. Bus is never on time. Fucking, can I just tell y'all I hate the RTC? Like I, re like, I really, really hate the RTC. Like, like, has anybody ever wanted to punch a bus driver while he's driving, though? Like, you just want to just wreck everything? <laughs> Like it's just like it's like like you were late, and I just want to just grab the steering wheel right as soon as he pull off. Just, just is I just like what they want to do. I just, and then I go back in the back and finish watching my porno. That's all I do. But if you are watching porn on the bus, uh, uh, fellas especially, uh, guys, I need you guys to be very wary of who's sitting behind you when you do it, because it's very tough to explain to a child why his name is on the back of some lady's on his name is on the back of some lady's shoulder. Mommy. That lady named son named Sean, just like me, and it's written in old English too, just like you, mommy. How do you explain that to, to your cut? You can't. I, I like her. So she's like, oh my god. <laughs> it gets real out here in these streets. <laughs> Thought I'd let y'all know. Shucks. But yeah, when I get a divorce, I decided I'm gonna go ahead and get me a dude and go ahead and go through the gay route there. You know what I'm saying? Just for the insurance benefits, I found out it's cheaper when you're married. The insurance is better, car, health, all that good stuff. But I thought about it, though. I can't be around, like, you know, like, you know, say, oh, I don't want to disrespect anybody, but I can't be with that. Yes, queen. I can't do that. <laughs> I can't do that. I need me a real one. I need me a real one on my squad. I need a real one. When he go buy his Glock 40, he buy me a matching 380. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He got to protect his boo-boo. He love me. You know what I'm saying? We got matching dicky suits so our fucking swap meet pictures look good. You know? He's good. One minute. I got one minute. I really got nothing else to tell you guys. What you guys don't know about me today? I watch porn on the bus. I'm disrespectful to bums. And whores, by the way. I'm very disrespectful to whores. <laughs> mm -hmm. I shortchange them every time. Yeah, that's it. I'm J. Cole Waterman. Make sure you guys follow me on everything, social media, Facebook, Instagram, all that stuff. And all you rappers and artists, make sure you guys get your music to me at jcolewater at gmail.com. You will be played this weekend. Thank you very much. You guys have been a business. Give it up for your host, Asia Jade. And your DJ over here rocking these...